Can she see this line? I knew from when I was young that I've always wanted to help people. In school, I know how, how your eyes can affect the way you learn. And they say about 80% 80, 80 of our learning comes from the way we see the world. Yeah, you can take a look at the mirror too, because you have to like it, right? All right. <laughs> To be able to help someone learn and help someone uh, be able to you know, impact their life has been something that I've always had at the forefront of you know, where I wanted to go. My name is Dr. Yura Vu. I'm the owner and doctor at Vu Eye Clinic located uh, east side St. Paul. Becoming an optometrist has always been a dream of mine since I was a, a, a little child. When I went to college I had a, an assignment and my, during my freshman year it was to, to kind of write a letter to someone I admire the most. And the person that I wrote who I admire the most was to my dad. Um, all the, the hardships that he overcame uh, coming to a, a new country, um, speaking uh, very minimal English, um, and raising a family of nine. Uh, I think my dad and my, and my mom were very, very instrumental in getting me here, and they kind of laid all the, the groundwork for, for me. I definitely had in my mind to be able to reach out to the Hmong community. And when I finished school, I felt like there's the best chance for me to be able to reach out to the community is to actually be here, be here to be able to serve everybody. And therefore I can actually see the, the, the needs and the demands of the community. Thank you for calling Blue Eye Clinic. This is Linda speaking. You know, one of the most profound impacts that I've experienced that I've had, you know, I've had uh, patients who were like 70 and 80 and, and never had an eye exam before with pretty dense cataracts. And upon uh, you know, just observation, you can tell that, that that cataract needed to be removed. Mita has been uh, very instrumental. Uh, they've helped me from the very first day just to kind of get me on track, consulting, meet with me, planning. And also uh, a big part was, was funding. Um, being new, recently new grad and out of school, it was, it was hard to get any kind of uh, loans to, to help me get on my feet. And I think that you know, Mita has been such a driving force in that uh, to help me get me where I am today. I'm very privileged to do what I do and to be here. I, I, um, you know, going into this, I definitely want to serve every community from you know, every background that as long as they you know, need that, my services, I'm, I'm always here at, you know, to help them back.